I'm cooking red beans and rice today. It's the red kidney beans that I'm cooking. Now, I want to talk to you about a little matter. You know that any kind of dried beans have a rather bad reputation. They are known at times to upset the stomach and cause some side effects that are quite disturbing sometimes. So I'm going to show you a little um, simple thing that you can do that will eliminate at least part of that issue because you just can't be out in public sometimes after eating dried beans. So what I'm going to do is take these red kidney beans and prepare them like I normally do. And I'm going to put them into a Dutch oven or you can use any large pot. Now I have the, the beans all ready. Got them picked and washed and they're in the Dutch oven covered with water. Now the next little thing I'm going to do is the trick that I promised you. The tip for making um, dried beans of any kind less gassy. All you have to do is take baking soda, the common baking soda that everybody keeps in their kitchen. Most people keep a box in their refrigerator to eliminate odors. So what I'm going to do, now normally I just take the box and kind of shake it and add a little bit, but for the sake of this video so you know about how much I'm putting. I'm going to put half a teaspoonful into the water. And I'm going to stir that around just a little bit. Now there's two ways you can do this. You can either start these the, the night before you're going to cook them and let them sit overnight with the baking soda water covering them. Now you don't have to change that water until you start to cook them. Just let them set. But if you forget to do that the night before or just decide all of a sudden that you want to cook dried beans, there is a faster way to do it. So you do the same thing. You wash your beans well, put them in a Dutch oven or other pot that you're going to cook them in and cover them with water, put a little baking soda, and then you put them on the stove and bring them to a full rolling bowl. Then you reduce the heat and you cook them just for maybe 10 minutes. Remove them from the heat source from your burner on the stove and let them set covered for about an hour. At that point, you drain the water off the beans, put fresh tap water, and start your cooking process. This little um, extra step that I do with the baking soda is what's known as burping the beans. So if you found this video helpful, please like and share, and thanks for stopping by.